Welcome back viewers, I am Prussian Prince and you are watching a let's play of Hearts of Iron 3, their finest hour. So what I'm going to do now is simply I'm just going to reorganize everything and add them to their HQs and such. What I'm going to do is I'm going to create an HQ over here. Detach all of them. I wonder what's the hotkey though. Wish I could know. But it's really nice that you can do it this way now. You can see you can make a core HQ really quickly. Effortlessly almost. So there we go, all of my HQs are ready. Almost. We've got some more divisions over here. Let's make some more. And there we go. We have some more units we have to attach. Not really. So as for interceptors, our naval bomb, some tactical bombers. Let's give uh, this leader for uh, naval bombers. As for tactical bombers, we can go with uh, the order by skill, tank buster. Now for interceptors, we've got. Let's give this guy. This is the rank here too, here as well. Now let's organize our navy. Let's see, battleship, battleship, battleship. And we need to use at least uh, the same amount of uh, screens. And screens are light cruisers, destroyers, and such. So, well, actually, they're the only two. I don't think there's another ship out there that can be classified as a screen. So yeah, we can have. Let's do six light cruisers and four battleships in our DB fleet. Now let's uh, send the subs somewhere else. Let's call this subs. Oh my bad, Not like that over here. Don't worry, I'm going to reorganize that a little bit later. Alright, so we've got... Let's go with the heavy cruisers. We've got eight of them right now. Let's add more light cruisers. I'm thinking about transports, but that's going to raise... I don't know how much it's going to... Our stacking penalty by quite a bit. Yeah, this is going to be transports, I think. What is it? Is it this one? Yes, it's called transports. DB like this. No, maybe let's call it like this. Battle fleet. Second battle fleet. Like that. And then first transports actually. Maybe we'll add more later on. And now let's do the subs. Let's use let's go with two subs. Each. And I guess we can have one with three, won't be a big deal. Let's select all of them. Redeploy over here. And then give, uh, let's give them some, uh, leaders. But first, let's give leaders to everything else. Transports. Let's give them, a one star, I guess. Battle fleet, the best we can get. Probably this second battle fleet is the best. Subs this is the first one actually. So Sea Wolf, do we have any? Uh, sea Wolf. Yes, we have this guy. Let's 
rank zero. Let's give some uh, rank two as well. Because in uh, their finest hour, leaders actually gain traits now. So you don't have to worry too much about giving them leaders that already have traits, though you should still do that. So now, we have, let's create the higher command for this. Add some cores to it. Third, fourth, fifth. Yeah, I like how it's way easier to do things now. Like, I could just select five divisions and create, press this little button and could attach them to, to a core. Well, it would create the core and attach them immediately on its own. Which is way nicer than just having to go through every division and attaching them. That was really horrible when I had to do that. I don't know why I didn't mean to make third army. My bad. Let's delete this. We don't need it yet. Match everything. Let's create another army group. Match second army to it. Now let's look at theater map mode. This is this one. Let's rename them to Europe. And the other one to Africa. Europe HQ and Africa HQ. Alright, so let's give this guy Logistic Wizard. Rank Logistic Wizard is not bad. First Army Group, rank 3 Logistic Wizard. First army, uh, actually, let's change this one, the skill 4, and then first army will get the uh, skill 3, Balbo, second army, let's get, uh, this guy's nice, Got logistic wizard. And also this guy too. Let's take this guy instead. So now for core, let's give some uh, leaders to them. How many leaders do we have? Very few, so let's give them rank zero logistic wizards. Four, four. Let's get this one. More logistic wizards, yeah. Fifth core. We gotta give rank one. Actually, let's not give rank one. Just get this one. Fifth core. No more defensive, uh, sorry, no more logistic wizard, it seems. I gotta give rank leader one, rank one, which I don't wanna, so. Let's give some rank zero guys to them. And I'm gonna start thinking about adding some mountaineer divisions. Let's add some higher skill to this, commandos. Commando. And this guy as well. Now we should upgrade these over here. Let's upgrade. Well, once everything else is done. But for now, let's just go as is. I'm gonna save just in case. There we go. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and go to diplomacy, see how things are going, are we still aligning? Yes, we are still aligning to access production is looking fine. 
Technology is also looking okay, I guess. Not the best, but it's looking okay. Politics looking fine. Intelligence looking fine. We haven't really like we're not we haven't been in a major war yet, so that's not a useful statistics tab as of yet. So let's continue the game and see how things go from here. And Europe HQ, I'm actually gonna strategically redeploy it over here. And I might actually have two, two theaters at the end of the day for Europe, one for West, one for East. I'm thinking about it. Because just for easier control. So yeah, we cannot add some more RT brigades, which would be nice for some of our units over here and over here. One, two, merge and merge. Let's keep going. Speed five. Make sure that we don't give more points to that. IC production is done. Let's stop it. Efficiency is going to be done soon, so we'll stop that as well. And there it goes. Efficiency is done. Stop researching it. Let's check through. We don't need medium tanks, really. But we we gotta we have to research that actually. I, I forgot because we need it for these little things. Let's gonna improve them. The medium tank gun, no, but these little things are going to improve them. Our SPR is what I'm talking about. So let's research that. Send it up. Yeah, we're going to have a tough time researching all we need. More arc teams in case. Merge over here. Good. Let's keep going. Alright, so we have our subs over here. And this guy, I wish this guy had a, an image because it makes me think that there's no leader attached. And we got it. Research more carrier stuff and get more IC, of course. Let's make like five IC all the time. Yeah, we could make a little bit more IC. Let's make it over here. Make five more IC, put it on top, and keep going. Oh, whoa, lots of things are getting researched. Don't need to tech rush this. We can tech rush the salt and we can tech rush this. No need to tech rush the naval. Let's see what else we can get. Mm, not too much. We could get supply production, but really we just need all the other techs at this point. Hmm. Hard to say. Oh, well, we'll just keep going. So we're going to deploy more RT. Let's see over here. Yeah, we need two more RT gates to deploy. Just for this particular corp. Corp, rather. Some more IC that's going to be ready next year, and that's probably when we'll stop IC production. 
Anyway, I'm gonna continue in the next part. So thank you for watching. See you next time.